Hi, I'm Madeline from Loom Love. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make the Rainbow Loom Rainbow Loom Bon Bon bracelet. Bon Bon is French for candy, so um, as you can see, it looks a little bit like candy. So your loom should be set up just like this with the arrow pointing forwards. What you're going to do is take two rubber bands. You're, you're doubling them, so just have two rubber bands, two single rubber bands together, and put it from the, this peg to this peg in the center. And push it down. And then take two bands, so you're doubling these bands. Take two bands and stretch it from here to here. And take another two bands and go from here to here. So it looks like half, just like that. So you're not doing this side yet. Now what we're going to do is you take two rubber bands. You're still doubling them. Take two rubber bands. Put it from here to here. And then take another two rubber bands and go from here to here. And then take another two and just stretch it out this peg to this peg so it looks like this now what you're going to do is double these bands too you're still doubling them so to take two rubber bands double them go from this peg to this peg so forwards in the middle forward now Take two rubber bands, so these are, as you can see, these are all doubled bands, two bands, and bring it from here to here. You're not going down, but you're going up. From there to there. And then take two rubber bands, go from here to here, and then another two rubber bands. And go from here to here. You also want to make sure you're taking two bands. And go from here to here. Make sure you do it in this order or else this bracelet will not turn out. Go from here to here. Let this band stretched. Go from here to here. And then go from this pin to this pin. Now we're going to be doing this row of pegs here just like we did before. So we're taking two rubber bands and going up just like that. Now we're going to do the same thing as we did before again. So we're going to go from here up from here to you're still doubling them and bring it up just like that and go from here from here and then finally from here and then take another color of your choice I'm doing clear and just go up just like we did there and we're going to continue this pattern all the way up the loom loom but stop right at the end here okay so now we've reached the end you want to stop here it should look like this now what you're going to do is take two rubber bands and go forwards so <coughs> just like that now we're going to be placing a capping band on this band on the, these rubber bands here on this peg. So what you're going to do is just take a regular rubber band, a single one, 
and double it as in a capping band way. So just like that. And then stretch it out on oops, this peg. Once you have your capping band on, you're going to start looping the bands. So turn your loom around. So now the arrow is pointing towards you. Now we're going to start looping. So what you're going to do is you're going to take your hook, pull back, this cat band we just placed and bring up the two rubber bands on the top Back. and bring it forwards so it looks like that just like a teardrop shape with two rubber bands now we're going to pull back that those bands that we just placed on this peg and grab the two on the top so not the bottom, but the top. And bring them to this peg. Now, I'm going to pull back these rubber bands. Grab the one that goes forwards. Now, we're going to pull back these rubber bands. And bring this band, these bands to this center pin here. So it kind of looks like a half of a star. Now we're going to be doing this side. So pull back that cat band, those bands, bring this, these two bands here, place it on this peg. Pull back that, grab the two on the top, bring it forwards, pull back these bands, bring it side, this side. See, as you can see, it looks like a star. Now we're gonna pull back all these bands. Be really careful because a lot of people break their hook in, in thick amounts of bands, and it happened to me. So what you do is pull back these bands, grab the two that go forwards. Make sure that they're all under, and that's good. So it should look like this. Push your bands down, and now we're going to be doing this, this shape here. So pull back this band, grab this band, these two bands, and bring them to the left. Now, pull back those, bring this forwards, push them down. Now, pull back this band and get these two bands. Good. Now, we've done the half star. Now, we're going to do this side. So, pull back that, grab the two that go right. Black the right rubber bands, <coughs> bring it forwards, and bring this one sideways. And pull back these. Make sure you pull them all back. And make sure you get the right rubber bands and get the clear ones here. So it should look like this. Now you're going to continue this pattern all the way up the loop. Go from here to here, do this side. Okay, now as you can see, we finished looping all the bands, so you're just going to push them all down good and tight. And now turn, it will be easier to do this if you turn your loom around. So turn your loom around now that the air is pointing forwards. Stick your hook down this channel of the loom. Now we're going to fish the bracelet. So take a rubber band, a single rubber band, 
put it on the hook. Just, just like just like that. And up the channel of the loop. So I'll put that single rubber band that's separated or in half and split and put it on the gripper of your hook. Now we're ready to take this project off the loom. There, it should look like this. Now this bracelet, as you can see, needs an extension. So what you're going to do is you take one rubber band or two, it doesn't matter, bring it from here to here, another one, bring it from here to here, here to here, here to here, here to here, and here to here. Now what you do is you take, stretch this out, put it on your two fingers, take it out of the hook, and stretch it on two rubber bands. So just like it looks like that. Now you're going to take your hook and just hook a single chain. Okay, so now we've done that. We don't take it off the loom just yet because we need to add a C clip. So we're going to stretch this band, these two bands, out to here. And you need a C clip for this, so just maybe bring it up a little bit and just oh, clip your C clip on. So just like that. Now. You can take it off the loop. Make sure it's on two, on the two bands, and attach it on this little sticking out part here, and put it on the C clip. There you have your Rainbow Loom Boom Boom bracelet.